Hey everyone, this is Tim. Welcome to Vancouver, Canada, my home. But I wish I could have picked a better day to welcome you because it's a little gloomy and cold. And if it's a little gloomy and cold where you are, thank you for joining because uh, I think together we can lift up the spirits. And what better way to uh, lift up the spirits than to have a great meal together. So I'm pretty excited. Uh, we're gonna meet up with some friends and thank you for joining as well. I'm actually in downtown Vancouver and it's quite a nice place. It's not only businesses, but there's retail and lots of things, uh, lots of retail and shops and restaurants to visit. And if you're ever around, uh, give me a shout. Love to uh, show you all the nice places. So before we go for our meal, uh, we've got two little ones joining us and a few big ones. So for the little ones, uh, I got a few things for them, but I think I'm gonna grab some snacks and some treats for them as well. All right, I think we'll get some Kinder Surprise. These are quite uniquely Canadian. Let's try a, the classic. It's oh, my favorite. All right, so we're done with the sweets. Now let's go for the savory. Uh, let's see what they have. Oh, great, and we can't go wrong with Pringles. Ah, uh, let's go with uh, ketchup. Sour cream and onion. And I get one more, and let's top it off with barbecue. So I think we got all the stuff. Uh, I think, and we're getting hungry. Uh, so without further ado, uh, let's go, let's go eat. excited uh, we are in global uh, this is kind of one of the nicer restaurants no, they don't normally have a buffet but this is a holiday season and I guess that's probably the best way to celebrate uh, I can't wait to show you what we have we're just gonna wait for our friends to arrive we're just waiting for our table and Ross is nice enough to pour us a nice glass of sparkling wine thank you so much oh perfect sound Thank you so much. Okay, cheers. cheers. So Albert and I are waiting for the table, and uh, I guess uh, as we wait, uh, cheers. All right. Hi. Hey, Jack. How are you? Hey, thank you for this wonderful table. That's not a problem at all. It's perfect. Thank wonderful. You. Happy with it so far? Absolutely. Awesome. Can't wait to get started on the buffet. Unreal. Yeah, the food's amazing. The chefs have been working on it since half past five this morning. All excited for you to eat the food. It's there to be eaten, so please. Enjoy. All right, thank you so much. Our friends are still coming, so I think I'm gonna take a head start on the buffet. So come on, join me. Let's check it out. Oh, Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas. Oh, so much food. I know. What's yeah. your favorite Santa? All of them. You know, All of them. All right, this Everybody is amazing. Love, you know? Excellent. Love. Enjoy, guys. Enjoy. All right. So pretty spectacular. They went all out. Uh, let me show you the buffet. So they have the dessert station over there, and it stretches all the way down here. So we can't wait to take you around. They've got uh, so many stations: a, car a, a carvery, a carvery, the appetizers, the hot food, and then the desserts. So let's start with the appetizers first. Okay, so I think we'll start right over there. They start you off with some healthy salads. And this looks pretty amazing. These are uh, prosciutto crostinis with cheese. Let's go for one of these. And smoked salmon with cream cheese on a mini bagel. Making a mess, but that's okay. And then a magnificent Caesar salad. Kale Caesar salad, just to be a little bit more healthy. And then salami, sun-dried tomato, goat cheese, little crostinis. 
really nice. And there's quite a bit more. Some pasta salads, really good. Some couscous. And some roasted veggies. Winter vegetables. Oh, that's nice. A caprese salad. And then behind that is a potato salad. So we are in the West Coast, so we've got some seafood coming up. Fresh oysters. Hi, Dorma, how are you? I, I guess you have one of the busier stations with all the oysters? All right. Well, they looks magnificent. How many have you been shucking? 1,500. 1,500 oysters. Dorma, can I uh, get an oyster? Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, two. Thank you. All right, fantastic people. And let's see what else they have. All right, so more seafood. I think this is an empty uh, crab stand, but there's uh, no fret. There's always more. Oh, look at these shrimp. Huge shrimp. And then there's uh, more crab. So let's grab one of these. And then some crab. I think I'm gonna come back for that later. It's a little bit of work. But, oh, seared tuna. All right, and then we have some croissants, some fruits. I guess it is brunch, even though it's uh, one. Cinnamon rolls. Not sure what these are, but I guess uh, there's only one way to find out. We can give it a try. Some watermelon. Some donuts, some, I think these are cheese bread. And then I'm just gonna go really quickly through this section because it seems to be all bread. But you can see all the hardworking people at the back. Out in the stove, you can see everyone working so hard there. That's a really nice paella. I can't wait for that coming up. Hi, Gihad. Hey. This looks amazing. I see right in front of a chocolate fountain. I hope you enjoy it. Awesome. And then wonderful paella. Okay. Very good. Love oh. Here. Oh. You have to try. Oh, thank you. Thank you. All right. Take care. All right. And then now we will come to the row of cloches. Let's see what we have. Some rigatoni. Short rib hash. Let's see what's in here. Some veggies and potatoes. And our uh, quintessential breakfast favorites. Some sausages, bacon, and then other breakfast favorites. Got some uh, French toast, oh, some waffles, some pancakes. So now I think it's time for some carvery. Hi Manny, how are you? This looks amazing. Wonderful turkey. Can I get your fattiest cut of turkey, like the dark meat, and then the fattiest cut of beef? Oh, nice and golden brown. Oh, that's perfect. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness, look at that. Thank you, Manny. Okay. So I think I need an omelet as usual. Hi, Lanka. Hi, this looks fantastic. Can I have a little omelette? Oh, how about a mushroom and bacon and shrimp? A little bit, yeah. Wow, so nice. Thank you, Lanka. Well, that's all right. Not bad. I think we're just gonna top this off with some salmon and some paella. So let me show you the plates I have. And this is a plate, a wonderful omelet from Lanka, some salmon, the paella looks amazing, the roast beef, and then the turkey, the fattiest cut we can have. Uh, terrific oysters from Dharma, the sh massive shrimp, seared tuna, this uh, nice bruschetta, salmon and lox, or salmon and cream cheese, and this, I have no idea what this is, but I can't wait to give it a try. 
Mm. It's crispy and pillowy and flaky. It's like a cloud of something. I don't know what it is still. Let's find out. Very good. Still no idea. A little bit sweet. Very nice though. We gotta mm. try this uh, prosciutto bruschetta with cheese and tomatoes. Yes, sir. Mm. That is heavenly. Fresh and cheesy. Nice salty ham. Very nice arugula. Now I normally say stay away from the bread, but not when it's like this. Really tasty. Mm. So the plate's emptying soon, but that's okay. We can get more. Well, let's try the tuna. Mm, very fresh, well seasoned, little sesame. Always really good. So I'm starting to finish off plate one, but there's more seafood. Let's dig into that paella. Mm. Soft and creamy, and velvety, and a little bit of spice. So we're gonna continue finishing this up. Maybe we'll get a few more drinks and then uh, go for some desserts. Oh, hey Ross. Hey, thank you so much for the uh, for the sparkling wine. It was fantastic. Yeah, no problem. So now we're gonna do a Caesar for you, my friend? No way. This is my first Caesar. A little bit of vodka. Oh. Are you okay with seafood? It's okay oh, seafood for you? Oh, absolutely. No, thank you so much. And this isn't included in the brunch. But the folks here were quite gracious and offered this as their compliments. I don't really take any freebies, so it was an interesting discussion with Jack to make sure he puts this on the bill. Oyster. Oh, wow. Not what I was expecting, but who knows. Oh, you made my day with the bacon? <laughs> That's great. Oh, more. Wow. Oh, geez. Ross, thank you so much. Thanks to you. All right. Cheers. Cheers. Mm, very nice. Spicy. <laughs> what a way to wake up. And the oyster in a drink is uh, really uh, tasty and interesting. All right. So... Ross is uh, pretty fantastic, never ending with the, uh, with the wine and the Caesars. So I think we're going to go for a couple more dishes and uh, we'll take you back for dessert. Uh, after four or five dishes and the wonderful drinks from Ross and the Caesar, uh, I think it's time for some dessert. And uh, let me grab a plate. All right, so I got my plate here. Oh, and I see Franklin up ahead. Franklin? Thank you so much for making me feel so welcome. Everyone's uh, having a blast. Thank you for coming and joining us. And Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays. So I'm just about to head off for the dessert. What's your favorite? Uh, my favorite dessert is the tiramisu. Tiramisu, okay. Always good. All right, thank you. And I got my big plate here. Awesome, so, so maybe you want, to take, you want to take a big chunk of tiramisu. You're not going to be this <laughs> All right, thank you so much. Uh, hi, Stephanie. Hi, thank you so much for keeping the dessert station all well stocked and everything. Welcome. All right, cheers. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you. Okay. So let's see what we have. Oh, this is uh, cream puffs, as uh, Franklin was talking about, with the crackle on top. Let's try a cream puff and a lemon tart. We have some pastries here. Some more lemon tarts, some cookies. We have Stephanie with more food there. Some cinnamon rolls. This looks like really nice banana bread. Some smaller cinnamon rolls. That's the uh, tiramisu. And the sign of a good tiramisu is that uh, most of it is gone. Let's give one of these a try. And then a uh, wonderful, uh, I'm not sure what this is but I think there's only one way to find out. And then this is another sign of a good dessert because there's only two left. 
This looks like a panna cotta. Cheesecake? Oh, these are cheesecake. Oh, oh, thank you so much. So people are so nice here. Thank you, sir. Canadians, right? All right. Stephen, nice. thank you so much yeah. for sharing the macaroons. Yeah, macaroons and everything is so nice. How is it? Oh, especially my friend to meet my friend. Oh, here. look at this. Beautiful plate. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Stephen. Uh, so people are quite amazing and uh, there's more desserts to come. All right. So we'll get a fudge brownie here. And then as Stephanie said, these are tiramisu number two, right beside tiramisu number one. All right, there's one thing that would make the macaroons a little better, and uh, that's with the help of a chocolate fountain. All right, so after a couple of hours, uh, we're back at the table. Let me show you what I have for the desserts. So this is my plate. Again, it's a modest station, but I think uh, we did uh, quite well. So Stephanie actually made the tiramisu's and she was saying, this one is good, this one's better. So we have a dessert of some sort, a cream puff. So these are cheesecakes, apparently. And then uh, that was that mystery dessert that I had at the beginning, which I thought was savory, but it was really good. I can't wait to try the macarons. Let's see how it tastes with chocolate. They taste messy. Okay, so that was a terrible mistake. Uh, macarons aren't meant to be dipped in chocolate. They get soggy. Let's try the uh, cream puff. Mm. The pat of choux is nice and crispy and the crackle makes it a little bit sweet and tart. Really nice and filled with raspberry. Mm. I can't wait to dig into tiramisu number one. Mm. Lots of mascarpone, really nice and creamy. And let's go for tiramisu number two. Mm, soft and velvety, really rich, but light at the same time. A nice liquid coffee, uh, so cookie, really tasty. So this is, uh, we're at Global uh, and welcome to Vancouver. Really nice place. They don't have a buffet every day. Um, regular dinner is amazing, but uh, so this is the holidays and we get treated to endless food. Thank you for joining us. Um, it really helps uh, lift the spirits. So until we see each other again, uh, cheers. Happy holidays.